guys, you're back with us. Uh, John, I always kind of prided myself on knowing people in the middle of nowhere. But, <laughs> <laughs> but we just stopped for that. Uh, um, Gosh, you you know people everywhere. Yeah, I know. <laughs> but, I mean, pretty well. With but the thing is, is outside of Cabrera or something like that. Yeah. yeah, in the middle of nowhere, and there's this little what was it, a restaurant? Little Colmado. Uh, Colmado. Little okay. Market. But you knew somebody. Yeah. I Pull over. Actually. I gotta say hello. Like, yeah, I know. Who? Uh, who? Who was this? They're just friends of mine from uh, many years ago who I kept in contact through, through friends from Nagua. Uh, it's in a small place called La Manzana, which means the apple, just um, just in between the uh, waterfall. And I hadn't seen them for over four years. Uh, every time I visited them, I stayed with them. And they have beautiful farm there with all fruits and vegetables. And I love to escape from the hustle and bustle in Nagua before. So I used to come here for long weekends. And they always treated me really nice. And I thought, let me go and surprise them. And they were very happy. They even said, come in for a coffee, have lunch. I'm like, no, I'm with my partner. We're, we're doing a tour, but uh, it's always great to catch up with people. And I do have a lot of friends in the middle of nowhere. Yeah, I'll say. Uh, <laughs> I mean, I, you know, for all you guys watching the video, I mean, that was just one. But, I mean, we've been in places in the middle of nowhere. And out comes somebody riding out of the bush with a horse on the top, you know. Johnny! <laughs> que paso? Yeah, exactly. In the middle of nowhere. But uh, again, I, I know most people don't venture out like we do, but we just love this stuff. Yeah. But uh, anyway, that, that is so, so, so cool. But anyway, uh, we'll catch up with you a little further on down the road. I'll splice in, John. And instead of spending so much time actually going to Lamoni, we've been there. Yeah. Um, we'll splice in some uh, B-roll video from previous. And uh, we'll use that, okay? We'll keep this little venture going and, and make it a multi-part. And uh, there's old Franklin Auto again, every which way you want it. That's a chain of auto stores, a family uh, that sells uh, cars all over the country. They have many Franklin auto uh, dealerships I guess is the word auto dealerships all over so anyway uh, Barry and Johnny here out for now we'll pick up with you down the road hey bud that's yeah, amazing uh, anyway it's it blows me away talk to you guys soon hey guys you're here with Barry and Johnny we just decided to stop for lunch on our day trip through before we had uh, we have some business later this afternoon uh, in, over in Agua at the attorneys but we wanted to take a few hours and just venture out and do some filming um, and we stumbled into a nice little uh, restaurant here, and uh, I thought uh, it'd be really great if uh, we could just get on camera. And uh, why don't you introduce yourselves to the folks? Hi, I'm uh, Guillermo, the manager from Santi Restaurant, a tour operator. We are here open from since last uh, 24 years ago, approximately. We are originally from Spain, but here in the restaurant we do uh, quite different kind of foods, locals and also some Europeans. Yeah, we're going to do like Alberi is always doing. Dame uh, explicar en español con Johnny. Do an introduction and uh, a little bit for our Spanish video okay. viewers, and uh, we'll mix this up and call it Spanglish, you know, okay. a little bit of each. Sí, uh, buenas tardes uh, todos aquí en uh, Something Feels Wrong. Estamos aquí en El Limón. Uh, estamos como andando hoy, dando un, como un viaje nuevo. Aquí somos con una persona que se llama Aguillermo. Sí, él es el gerente de este restaurante aquí. Y Nosotros pasamos una comida muy bien, comida fresco, local e internacional. Entonces es como un placer para nosotros para hacernos una, una, una entrevista con Aguillermo. Sí. Uh, maybe just for, for the viewers, though, uh, just explain a little bit about yourself. and Because and, uh, okay. when people come, uh, we're going to put your card on. So in most cases, they're going to not even call us. They're going to go directly to you. Okay, that's what it's all about. Perfect. So tell in tell Espanol. Espanol? Okay. Yeah. Más fácil. Yo soy natural de España. Llegué a Samaná, a la provincia de Samaná, hace siete años. Estoy casado con Dominicana y me fascinó desde que llegué la primera vez. 
Entonces, soy un enamorado de Samaná, es una de las tierras más hermosas de la República Dominicana. Y ahora, desde hace un tiempo, trabajando con, con Santi en su restaurante y tour operador de excursiones, nos dedicamos un poco a la promoción turística de, de Samaná, tanto de manera interior en República Dominicana como en el extranjero, en España, Francia, Estados Unidos, Sudamérica, en todos los países a los que las redes sociales nos llegan. Son 24 años de experiencia, con lo cual pues ya tenemos un target ahí de, de clientela y tenemos una reputación que nuestra banderita de TripAdvisor pone que somos buenos. Tell about the, um, you provide, now we're going back to English, um, you provide uh, tours for folks all around with dune buggies and, and horseback ride tours and beach tours and things of that nature. And there's always somebody that speaks English for the uh, English visitors that would come here so they don't feel lost. Is there a message? Yeah, of course. Uh, if, uh, if I'm here, of course, I'm going to treat you like, a, like an American, so no problem. But in case I'm not here, we have some locals that they are standing doing uh, some English classes, English courses. Also, they know at least the minimum phrases to, mm -hmm. to treat the, our guests uh, that they go to the waterfall in Limon. Mm -hmm. Or we do ITS National Park always with a national guide in English, French, German, all, all the languages. We provide a tour, uh, tour guides. And then uh, here we are a, a local uh, local tour operator, so we don't like uh, too much the massive tourism. Mm -hmm. Our groups normally are from 20 to 30 people maximum, because you are not a number. You are a friend, and I'm going to show you the best of some so it's my, Excellent. my way of doing, it's our way of doing the, the trips, and uh, also the restaurant. Uh, it's our way of working. We're going to uh, stitch in some uh, still photos while, uh, so you're not watching three talking heads for the whole time about uh, what we had for lunch, okay? Uh, totally fresh, and uh, you guys will see from the pictures yourself. It just, uh, it's so obvious, it's ridiculous. Uh, I really want to thank you for taking a few minutes of your time to make us feel at home. Thank really you goes so a long way. Uh, you will. Uh, also, though, you want to close this off uh, in Espanol for the... Uh, Sí, es final. Sí, entonces en final eh, nosotros queremos decir muchas gracias por su tiempo a Guillermo. Eh, fue un placer aquí eh, eh, compartiendo con ustedes, eh, conociendo más de su lugar. Eh, si Dios quiere, tenemos un amigo, podemos compartir junto en el futuro. Ya tiene su casa aquí en El Limón. Así Muchas que gracias. Son bienvenidos eh, siempre. ¿Cómo se llama el restaurante por la gente? El restaurante es Santi Restaurante, el restaurante de Santi. Sí, es la mejor comida fresca aquí en El Limón. Y muchas gracias y hablamos pronto con Something Feels Wrong. Guys, it's Barry and DR. We'll talk to you soon and we'll catch you on the flip side. Uh, we're going to head down towards the beaches in this area and Button up in the back seat and come along with us. We'll talk to you soon. Bye. Bye. Bye.